What's good, yo? We back with another video. We got unfortunate news for Sugar Hill Keem and his younger brother, O.Y. Kwan. They were both sentenced recently, and unfortunately, it looks like they're going to have to sit down for a couple years at least. We're going to start out with Sugar Hill Keem. Sugar Hill Keem being the older brother and the bigger rapper. He was locked up almost a year ago, last year on May 19, 2022, and that was a whole separate case of why he got picked up. We're going to talk about that later. But the incident that he did plead guilty to and ended up getting sentenced was from 2021. It was criminal possession of a weapon of the second degree, a loaded firearm. And in this case, he had a slew of other charges. You see reckless endangerment up there whole bunch of possession of a firearm loaded firearm charges but the one he did cop out to was attempted criminal possession of a weapon of the second degree a loaded firearm and they put the weapon being a handgun and he did have court on the 27th of april and after pleading guilty he was given five and five meaning five years in prison and then five years of parole after he's released don't know if he's gonna do the full five but he does have a year served so hopefully that's counted and hopefully get like a year knocked off for good behavior meaning he could be out by 2026 which seems so far away but it is what it is and Keem might have to stay longer because he does have another charge and another sentence state coming up for the 2022 charge. And if you don't know about that, the police say he was caught with being in possession of a weapon. And for this charge, it's criminal possession of a weapon, second degree, loaded firearm, a class C felony. And he pled guilty to that. He has court coming up on a second. But basically, to sum it all up, he got five years, basically maxed out on the first charge. And he basically pled guilty to a higher charge that could hold more time. And he could be sitting in there for a while if they don't run concurrent and if he don't get time served. Hoping the best for Keem. It's crazy. The New York laws are strict. Basically, he got caught trying to protect himself twice. And in doing so, he now has to sit in there for at least a couple years, unfortunately. Free Keem, but moving on to his younger brother, Quan. Like the brothers they are, like the twins we thought they were, they got sentenced on the same day. Quan being arrested in August. Everybody thought, including myself, that Quan, with Keem being locked up, Quan would take over for Sugar Hill. But that didn't last long, only being out a couple more months and being locked up for a, a way more serious charge that we'll get into later. Quan would plead guilty to the charge that Keem is waiting to get sentenced for, the criminal possession of a weapon, second degree, loaded firearm, class C felony. He pled guilty to, got four years and three years parole, meaning that Keem can get a similar fate with the four years or less or more, depending on certain circumstances. But for Quan, he's fighting two separate cases for a similar incident he's locked up for attempted murder and when he got picked up for that when the cops came to arrest him for that he also picked up another loaded firearm charge in a separate case so he has two open cases for basically the same incident and free keem free kwan i don't want to see anybody locked up for just trying to protect themselves and it sucks because keem in 2022 he just got into a groove 2021 people were labeling him the worst joe rapper ever calling him terrible trash and then in 2022 he was doing crazy numbers and still doing crazy numbers everything on his channel basically got 500k plus multiple songs got millions of views and i really hope this isn't the end for him because he has a lot of talent and he showed off that talent in 2022 i remember he got locked up i think early 2022 got locked up for a couple months and then came home and just got in that groove dropping every week and everything he dropped was hitting a million views but he does have a year time served and hopefully both possession charges run concurrent meaning he could be out in a couple years on good behavior because it's still crazy to me 2026 that seems so far away Free Keem, Free Kwan. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments down below. I'm going to get up to it. Appreciate sure y'all for rocking with me. Keep doing y'all. Keep doing me. Be safe. Stay dangerous. Good.